Good morning. All right, let's see this on programming languages, one of my favorite subreddits. Where are programming languages created a zoomable map? Okay, let's click on this. Okay. Yeah, click on this. All right, what do we got here? Well, that's kind of interesting. Let me make my ugly mug smaller. Wow, look at this. It looks like most languages come from the US and Europe. In particular, Central Europe, Italy, Germany, UK. Now, of course, maybe there's some English bias, but wait, there's lots, lots coming from Japan, too. This, Oh, in this strip of the world, New Zealand and Australia. Even one in Perth, it looks like. Uh, what's this? All right, that looks like a bug. Maybe uh, there's another bug here. Okay, looks like there's two bugs. But boy, there's a lot of a lot of uh, data points here, and we. So it looks like India. It looks like there's two down here and down here. I've never been to India, so I don't know what those cities are. What's this? Okay, so this is Taiwan. Looks like it produces a bunch, and now down here looks like Brazil is well represented. But then there's a lot. I mean. Central America, we got Mexico, but I'd, I feel like I'd expect more languages from South America. That's interesting. So maybe there's a bias of uh, we don't have the names of a lot of these labs that are in South America. That could be interesting. In Africa, we really don't have a whole lot of information on Africa, so we're probably missing names of the labs again. And what's this? Oh, this is Hawaii. <laughs> Now I notice we don't have space and you know, my, my own scroll and stuff. We should have that. Brex Lab is over here. So there's some, some bugs, but look, we can zoom in. Let's take a look at America first. Wow, look at that. Can we zoom in further? Can we go further? Oh, wow, we can go. Okay, let's go. Let's check out California. Wow, look at all those languages. Where are they all? pop up and then LA what's this is this Santa Barbara so it looks like there's a little bug in the um, um, <laughs> data wrapper where you, you would expect this to hover over like the big one right maybe maybe I'm wrong maybe it is working I think they they may have fixed it already because we reported that to them okay Oh, that's where you see Riverside is? I'm not sure. Harvey Mudd, Caltech, and Pasadena. What's over here? Arizona State, Fortran, University of Arizona, Fort Knox. So it looks like a little, a couple of these like one-liners. Oh, here, here's some, a couple more bugs. So looks like some of these tiny ones are, are buggy, but generally it looks like these ones are pretty accurate. Here's here's where Austin is. I don't know if that's where AT&T is. That could be a bug. Um, cool. But look at this stretch. Brand, we got, so we got DC is here. We got New York up here. What's that big one? IBM, famously New York, Brown, of course, and then, of course, let's, we got to zoom into the Boston area, and we got MIT, we got Harvard, nothing, <laughs> nothing down here in South Boston, unfortunately. Uh, cool, what's up here in Maine? I don't know what that is. Dartmouth, of course. Oh, and Canada's getting, getting in. University of Toronto, Michigan. Oh, Michigan's up there? Is that where Detroit is? Why did I think it was over here? What's over here? Argonne. That's where Argonne is? Oh, the like Chicago area. What's this? Yeah, so it does look like... Oh, there's where Wolfram is. Ah. It's cool to just see these little pockets of innovation. Let's go across the pond. My goodness. What country is this? Is this Germany? Oh my goodness, look at West Germany versus East Germany. 
definitely notice a big difference. The lingering effects of the Cold War. And again, this could be the we could be biased to prefer languages that are in the English, but Italy Italy is producing a ton. I mean, there's probably a heavy English English bias in, in, in this data set. UK. Is this Dublin or something? Yeah, Dublin's over there. In Ria, my goodness. Coke or Camel. Wow, they produce some cool stuff there. Anyway. Lots of interesting stuff. Look at this. You can see where innovation is happening. Places to be. Oh, Israel. Look at that. It's kind of neat. And then look. I'll click on labs so we can see all the data. Um, we can let's drill in, see what's made at Microsoft. Cool. TypeScript, C sharp, PowerShell, Haskell. I mean, wait, Haskell? Oh, Parley made at Microsoft, maybe. Haskell seems to be, looks like it was made in a lot of different places. They produce some good stuff there. Well, anyway, in Rhea, look at that, one of the tops. Um, Interesting stuff. 